Hello, in this demo, we will showcase some of the features of the USB validator suite and how it can be used for stress testing USB 3.0 compliant hosts and hubs. We will start by demonstrating the simple procedure for setting up the validator suite and then demonstrate some of the interesting testing scenarios such as error injection and device initiated low power entry exit cases. The USB validator suite setup consists of three components. A test machine which runs a test suite software, an XHCI compliant host which is the component we are stress testing, and a USB validator device which together with the software running on the host creates interesting test scenarios. To set up the system, we will connect the XHCI host to a PCI port of the test machine and power it up. Next, we power up the validator device and connect it to the XHCI host using a USB 3.0 cable. The super speed link is established as link enters U0 state. The USB validator setup is now complete. We can run LSUSB to verify that the host has detected the validator device. The system is now ready to run the stress tests. Let's start by running a test that performs 50,000 in transfers of 64,000 bytes each. Test takes 15 seconds to complete which means that the host can support 1.7 Gbps of data rate at software level. This kind of performance testing cannot be done with off-the-shelf devices. When coupled with an analyzer, the power of the USB validator is truly unleashed. The user can switch on error injection by simply adding another parameter to the test command line. Errors are randomly injected over hundreds of thousands of packets during the test run. In this case, we are enabling the validator device to inject errors into link commands. Changing the type of error to inject is very simple. Now the validator injects errors on headers and the analyzer shows us that the link partners have successfully performed a link level retry. The USB validator can be used to check all legal low power entry exit sequences. Off the shelf devices cannot test device initiated low power entry exit sequences. The USB validator bridges this gap. The low power tests can perform hundreds of entry exit sequences as part of a single run. Additionally, the user can vary the LFPS handshake duration parameters of the validator device in order to create different test scenarios. The low power entry exit sequences can be debugged with an analyzer. Here we see a device initiated U1 entry along with device initiated U1 exit sequence. To summarize, the USB validator suite is a versatile tool which can test various hardware and software layers of the USB stack. Please contact us for more information.